this week for my reading challenge. I'm trying to finish a book each week. I read The 33 Strategies of War, the concise edition. Uh, the 33 Strategies of War was written by Robert Greene, who is an American author. Uh, he has a BA in Classical Studies, according to his wiki. Uh, he's read a number of interesting books. He read the, wrote The 48 Laws of Power, which I really enjoyed. Uh, the Art of Seduction, which personally I couldn't get into, but that's just who I am. And 33 Strategies of War, and he's written more books besides these. Uh, this is the concise edition. It's a, like a compilation of Machiavelli, Nietzsche, Sun Tzu, Miyamoto Musashi from the Book of Five Rings, the I Ching, Napoleon. Uh, it's a really excellent distillation of war strategy. Um, I really enjoyed the concise edition because it has very interesting quotes and additions to the side of each page in the red, you can see that. So that's really cool. Uh, and it puts a lot of the information into context. I thought I'd read a couple of excerpts for you guys. The superior strategist understands that it is impossible to control exactly how an enemy will respond to this move or that. To attempt to do so will only lead to frustration and exhaustion. There is too much in war and in life that is unpredictable. But if the strategist can control the mood and mindset of his enemies, it does not matter exactly how they respond to his maneuvers. If he can make them frightened, panicky, overly aggressive and angry, he controls the wider scope of their actions and can trap them mentally before cornering them physically. I thought that was a quite nice uh, quote to apply to Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. Uh, the next one, the river. It flows with great force, sometimes flooding its banks and creating untold damage. Try to dam it and you only add to its pent up energy and increase your risk. Instead, divert its course, channel it, make its power serve your purposes. I really enjoy Robert Greene's books. Uh, if this sounds like something for you, check it out.